The Morgan State Bears won for the first time this season at homecoming, defeating the Savannah State Tigers 48-28. They played in front of a crowd over 10,000 that included students, alumni, and former players as well. The offense was led by quarterback Elijah Staley, who had his best game of the season, throwing three touchdowns and no interceptions. You know, we, we just executed like we were supposed to do, like we've been working all week in practice. And like I said, my teammates, you know, it, was just, it, it was just exciting to watch them play. You know, I was out there throwing balls, and I was like, wow, man, this is amazing just, you know, being out here, just watching them play, do what they do. I think we made less mistakes. I think we were able to capitalize on some of the opportunities that we had. And my guys just played better. They were locked in, they were focused, and they just did more of what we asked them to do. And I think if we can continue to do that, I think we're going to continue to develop, play better, and continue to be in a position where we have a chance to finish off in the end of the ball. The RTC cadets had to do a lot of push-ups, with the Bears scoring seven touchdowns, the most since the 2015 season. The defense continued its strong performance from the season, forcing Savannah into three turnovers and limiting them to a negative eight yards rushing. Down to 10. They took a 34 point lead into the fourth quarter, the largest lead of the year. Fans and cheerleaders celebrate the performance, joining together for a routine during the fourth quarter. The play of the game came on a deep pass to receiver Manasaw Bailey in the second quarter. On a big play, yeah. my coach, he was standing right beside me. He said, just run, just run, because he know I'm, I'm, I'm kind of fast. Mm -hmm. So he said, just run, just run, just get out there. He said, go. Ball was snap, and I just took off. The Bears hope to continue this momentum into next week when they head to D.C. to take on Howard for their homecoming. This has been Blair Young for Bear TV News.